Hey, what's up you guys? My name is Nathan and if you're on this video right now because you have thoughts of quitting, no matter what it is, if it's business, relationships, sports, something that you've set a goal in and you feel like quitting, I wanna share something with you that is very powerful that I believe if you take this and you learn from it, it can help you. So I'm gonna share a little bit of my story over the last few months in my, my business, okay? And so I started a few years ago as an internet entrepreneur, okay? I saw people making money online, creating their own businesses, making all this money, creating success, and I wanted a piece of it. I wanted to be able to create a business that I, I love, I'm passionate about, and also make a killing at the same time. And one thing that you'll find if you ever do venture into online business and entrepreneurship is that you have to be passionate about what you're doing. And the reason is because you're going to want to quit at one point or another. And I think that this, you know, it, it goes across a lot of different things. Something that you initially start on, there's going to be roadblocks, there's going to be things that make you want to quit. And the first thing you have to understand is that this is natural. It's natural as humans when we are faced with resistance to want to quit. So I'm going to share something uh, as part of my story that I hope inspires you to keep going, keep striving for your goals, no matter what they are. So uh, earlier this year uh, in February, I was partnered with a company uh, and it was bringing in income for me for my online business and it, I had in, in January was my first six thousand dollar month in my business all right it's the most money I had ever made over the last couple two or three years since starting my business and I was excited uh, my business was growing and that company shut down okay so the cash flow that was coming in I had lost it all. And so I want you to understand something. At this point in time, I felt like quitting. I felt like giving up because I had done all this work over the last two or three years. And I started creating some success. I had some wins. I was celebrating those wins and I was excited because I was looking forward to growing my business. But this was like a punch in the gut because everything seemed like it was crashing down. And I've been building my business part-time from home, from this office that I'm in right now filming this video, part-time for a few years. And I saw progression, I was excited, and then it just stopped. And so here's what I wanna tell you guys, hopefully you get something out of this. I decided not to quit, not to quit. And so at the time when this happened, I continued to grow my business without having revenue coming in, all right? Because I had no source. I, I you know, I was using uh, other people's companies to pay me. And so what happened next has changed my life completely. And so instead of giving up, I pressed forward, I pressed on, and from February to now at the time of filming this video, June, I've made over $300,000 in my business. And I know that may be hard to believe for some people. And sometimes, I, right now, I'm, I still can't believe that. Is this my life? Is, this my, is that my paycheck? It's unbelievable. And so I, I want you to understand that you don't have the power to see the future. You don't know what the outcome is gonna be. And so you have two options. You have, you have two options here. One, you can either expect the worst, which means you're quitting, because that's why most of us quit, is because we don't expect to win. When something gets hard, when we, we're up against resistance, that's the reason we wanna quit, is because we lose sight of winning. We lose hope that we can do it, all right? And this goes for anything. And then there's a second option, where you can still have a vision of winning, of succeeding, of having that, that faith, that belief when you first started, that you could do it. Or 
Otherwise, you wouldn't have started to begin with. So that's how I know that you had a belief to begin with. Otherwise, why did you start in whatever venture you're on? Why did you start? And what happens is we get knocked down and our belief gets shattered. So I want to encourage you guys to think about the reason you started. Have that belief that you had when you initially started. Hang on to it. Believe that you can do it. And if you're going to act like God and predict the future, predict winning. Expect to win. And I believe that half of everything in our life in creating success is mindset. It's mindset. And the reason is because I've seen it so many times. You'll get multiple people, right? You'll get two people. They'll get exposed to the same information, the same training, the same steps, the same everything. One person will go, go on to create massive success with the same information while the other person fails miserably and maybe not even just fails, but they ended up quitting. And the difference was that the one who succeeded believed they could, all right? And I know you guys have probably heard that, that quote, the man who believes he can and the man who believes he can't are both right. So my friends, I hope that you choose to expect to win, even when things get hard, even when things get hard. Creating success in anything isn't easy. Otherwise, everyone would be successful. And so I believe that if you're watching this video, you have something inside you. You have something inside you that will allow you to push on, to push through. So hopefully you've taken something from my story that quitting wasn't an option. I thought about it. I wanted to, a big part of me wanted to, but guess what? My mind was sound and I chose to believe that I could press on and create success in my business and whatever the case may be for you guys. So choose success, choose the belief, press on. I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye for now.